cliff from Bear River on March 15th, 2023, 2024, March 15th, 2024. The flow was at 200 on Monday, went up to 500 on Wednesday, and it's back dipping under 300 today on Friday. So uh, in the areas where the river's fairly channelized, it's not such a big deal. On the wetlands, it was pretty devastating. But time will tell and we will watch. The water is getting clearer. And right through here, the river is okay. And there is a plethora of little ducks. I've been watching them down in the pool and I just saw three of them um, fly up river and there was one flying across and then there's one right out there in front of us just hanging out so it's a great time for ducks at Bear River they think this is awesome so we're happy that Bear River is surviving I don't know what all the acrobatics is with uh, PG&E our favorite power company and uh, <clears throat> what they did as far as the flows going up and down and saying, oh, we have an emergency outage, so it dove a thousand cubic feet per second in a week. Uh, and uh, the river just keeps flowing, and that's what we pray for is a flowing river. And way down there, I could watch the ducks frolicking in that um, still water down there. They're jumping and swimming and making wakes. And I'm like, is it beavers? Is it beavers? Nope, it's ducks. Happy ducks, loving Bear River. And a couple of them came riding the current while I was playing. And last time, same thing. And they dive under and float up and they just bob on the water, having so much fun. So I love the life. Bear River's life. Miniwachoni, this water is life. <laughs>